Lexington. Now, your forecast from Fox 56 News, the weather authority. Well, it wasn't too bad out there today. We saw plenty of sunshine pretty much all day long. And while it was on the cool side, still didn't feel too bad. Fairly nice for this time of year outside right now. We still have some filtered sunshine Lexington and back towards Paris. You can see the flags whipping in a slight breeze there up in Paris. We have the cloud cover that's pretty much settled in across our southern and southwestern most areas. You can see that here Somerset, even Cumberland Falls, not as bright. We're holding on to the sunshine just a little bit longer here to the north, but clouds will continue to increase for all of us as we head into the overnight. That's all thanks to this system back off to the west. And while it looks fairly impressive right now, by the time it gets in our direction, it really just brings the chance for some storms and a few showers, mainly tomorrow afternoon and into the evening and overnight. And that's what we're tracking here as the next big thing. This is around 8 a.m. or so. Notice we're dry, but we do have some of that cloud cover around here. This will lift a little further to the north here, and by tomorrow afternoon and evening, we start to see some showers and a few storms fire up here. Then it'll linger into the overnight and early Saturday. I think this model's overdoing it a little bit for Saturday morning because by the time we really get into the day, we dry out. Most of the weekend looks dry for us, which is some good news. While there may be a spotty shower or two, doesn't really look like a big deal. You can enjoy the warmer weather, but then as we head towards Monday night into Tuesday, this cold front is going to start to work in our direction and will bring us the risk for some showers and storms once again. That's when it looks like the most widespread threat. 63 right now in Lexington, that's 65 in McKee, 68 in London, 66 right now down in Somerset. Tonight, temperatures falling through the 40s into the mid to some areas lower 40s, increasing clouds and not as cold for us. Tomorrow, we make it up to a high of around 73, so we're slowly starting to warm things back up. Partly sunny and a few storms possible again, mainly in the afternoon and evening. Tomorrow, by any means, does not look like a complete washout, and really the weekend overall doesn't look like it'll be a washout. Warmer air is moving in. That's really the big story I want to highlight as we head into the weekend. We're talking about it feeling more like summer. Saturday, we're in the upper 70s, some areas even the 80s. By Sunday, 83, and even Monday, still in the lower 80s. It's feeling like summer. Seven-day forecast looks like this. Storms possible tomorrow. Again, not a complete washout. The bigger story on Saturday, along with the warm-up, isn't going to be the threat for an isolated shower or two. It's really going to be the windy conditions on Saturday. We're breezy once again. Again on Sunday with a mix of sun and clouds and then more storm chances work in here next week. Again, more widespread Monday night into Tuesday with some spotty storm chances Wednesday and Thursday. Colby.